Hey guys, welcome back. Well, when life hands you lemons, make lemon curd, I say. But anyway, jokes apart, I am all for citrusy desserts and with lemon curd at hand, you can easily drum up some desserts last moment. Ever since I had to come up with an eggless version of lemon curd in one of our restaurants for demand from a guest, I now tend to use this version in my recipes. Making a good eggless lemon curd was a bit of a challenge, but you know what, I got there eventually. This is spot on in flavor, it's lemony, it's bright, it's sweet and buttery. I agree, it's not as bright yellow as it is supposed to be without the help of eggs. Nevertheless, use the brightest lemons you can find and let's get cooking. Lemon curd is absolutely easy to make and this is an eggless variation, so it's, it's much better. It sounds quite daunting, but literally it is just butter, it's sugar, it's lemon juice, it's thickened with some cornflour and sweetened with condensed milk. As simple and easy as that. First goes in butter. All this goes into a pan, which is being heated. Sugar. And lemon juice. Now, you can use lemon juice from the bottle. It works perfectly fine. That's okay. If you want to add, you can also add a lemon peel or rind as such. You know, you can uh, grate them and you add it in, you give a nice flavor. But I just feel that the lemon already has a very strong flavor of its own. By adding more lemon peel, it might become very intense. But again, it's a personal preference. I'm going to wait for this to come to a boil. The liquid has come to a boil. At this stage, you lower the heat and you let it just gently simmer. All you want to do is you want the sugar to melt and also the butter to melt through. So that is going to go into a gentle simmer and remain warm. In the meantime, I'm going to take corn flour and a little bit of cold water and make it into a paste. So the corn flour is actually going to thicken the lemon curd. And then on a low heat, I keep stirring it till the lemon curd thickens to the right consistency, which is more like a custard. This has been bubbling away very gently and I've been stirring it and this is what you get. Like a nice thick consistency. Very much like a custard in many ways. Normally they add eggs into the lemon curd and make it like a custard. But this is a fantastic cheat. Very easy to make. And lastly to sweeten it, I'm going to add condensed milk. all of it nothing goes to waste in my kitchens and we just stir it together it mixes quite well with the lemon curd it thickens and it will be set to go 
in the fridge. The lemon curd has mixed up quite well with the condensed milk. This is all set. I'm going to switch off the heat and just do a little taste. Always taste your food before you give it to your guest or keep it anyway safely to use for later on. Oh wow, very nice. Nice flavors of uh, lemony, most important thing. It's got a citric flavor to it, but the sugar gives it a very nice balance at the very last. Very nice. The lemon curd is all set. I am going to have one more taste. I just love lemon. You know what, in my house, I'm the only person who loves lemon, everything very citricky, citrusy. My wife absolutely hates too much of lemon, but for me, it's just fantastic. I have it with almost everything. Oh, beautiful. Very nice flavors. I'm going to transfer it into a glass bowl. Okay, put it into a jar. This will stay in your fridge for a good one week at least. I made a large quantity because I am going to do a lot of derivatives from this. There are a lot of things you can do with lemon curd, a lot of variations you can do with lemon curd. But this is a very basic one. And the best thing is, this is an eggless recipe. So make sure you guys try it at home, cook it for your friends and for your family and leave your comments on the section below. Till then, happy cooking and bon appetit.